Shooting at Mays High School yesterday was the third reported shooting at a Metro Atlanta school in the month of February. Tonight, parents coming together to work on a new safety and security plan for their school after the shooting at McEachern High School in Cobb County at the start of the month. And so now they're demanding action and results. Here's 11 Alive's John Sherrick. Not quite 100 people, a fraction of McEachern High School's students and parents showed up to come up with a plan to stop school violence here. But these parents and students who did show up. More than anything else, we're married to this community, we're married to this school, and we want to keep it safe. They believe their voices will be heard by the Cobb County School Board and Superintendent. Benjamin and Sharon Carter, parents of a McEachern student, know what they want the plan to include, starting with the basics, such as a vulnerability assessment of McEachern and more school resource officers. More funds provided to uh, make the school safer, securing the entrances, name tags for the kids, and more parent involvement. Also others calling for facial recognition video systems inside the schools and license plate recognition systems in the parking lots. Being proactive versus being reactive. Cobb County School Board member Trey Hutchins, who organized this series of town hall meetings, is already talking with other schools across Metro Atlanta about collective action. I think this is going to allow us to have some action items that our school districts can use to ensure school safety across the board. Once and for all. Yes. Hutchins urging parents in this small but possibly mighty crowd and others to show up again at the next Cobb County School Board meeting in two weeks to begin to present their plan of action. At McEachern High School in Powder Springs, John Shearick, 11 Alive News.